What happens when you get a sliver that goes inside your hand, you're not able to poke it out, it gets infected. And so it builds up just like a pimple would on our face. And if that pimple pops, that's a heart attack. So it can what we call rupture without having any occlusion. In fact, 70% of heart attacks will occur with a blockage that is below 50%. Wow, that's, that's, that's that doesn't, yeah, that seems, uh, yeah, interesting. Because it's a pimple popping or a plaque rupturing and sometimes it can dissolve. So what, what I'm trying to say is that when you start to do an angiogram, and then what they started to see is that they, they would do intravascular ultrasounds of the, of the ultrasound. And now they're going in with a camera and poking around and they're, they're starting to see things like SCAD, which is spontaneous coronary artery dissection, vasospasm, microvascular disease. And we're starting to see that with functional testing to the angiogram, where they inject some dye and they, they can see the reactivity of what's happening to the arteries. They never used to do that before. And now with the women in, that have come into cardiovascular care and they're becoming cardiologists and they're starting to see it, you're starting to see more of these women come up in the field of cardiology.